Hello my children, it's me again. As I told you before, today we have uh, many videos of me talking to you. Uh, let's see here, what are we going to do? Please open your workbook on page 52 and let's try to answer these questions together. They are the two yellow pages that we have the review for um, from uh, unit four till six it's okay i know we finished some stuff from the first semester but let's remember them together and if you have any problem with anything please get back to me uh, the first exercise is very easy you have to look at the numbers in the picture and choose the right answer you have all the words on top in the uh, yellowish box on top you have apple bag book board chair computer desk mobile phone notebook pen pupil rubber ruler and teacher is already done for us so you have to choose the right word and write it in the right space uh, number b it's the same thing you have to choose the right word from between the two red words that you have in the uh, sentences you have to look at the pictures pictures of our reporters remember them trek and his friend ty the panda mia the meerkat and leo the leopard remember and again you have to choose the right word from between the two red words and it again and again i'll keep saying this it has to make sense don't just choose the word that you think is right no you have to read the sentence again and make sure it makes sense to you let's see number c you have to put one of these answers in the spaces you have are there is there there are there are and there is and there isn't okay it's very easy uh, we said before that whenever we have only one thing you have to choose always verb is and if we are talking about many things it has to be are okay there is and there are let's see number two any apples any apples and we said before that any we use it when we have not when we are talking that we don't have something okay so the answer here is going to be there aren't why because at the end of apples we have plural s okay so we have to choose r because we are talking about many things okay and why did we say that the answer is going to be in the negative because we have any we have any okay let's see the next part number three any books any books no there aren't no there aren't let's see here what do we have huh are there any books are there any books why did we say that the answer here is are there because we have huh plural s in the word books okay and of course there is another reason i don't know if you take care of it because in the answer we have aren't aren't number four 11 boys in the classroom 11 boys in the classroom which answer is going to be there are or there is huh there are because boys have huh the word boys has plural s number five a monkey in the tree a monkey in the tree here it's going to be a question how did we know that because we have question mark and if we have question mark huh how is it going to be it has to be is there a monkey in the tree is there a monkey in the tree number dress number six a dress there is a skirt a dress there is a skirt huh which one are we going to choose there isn't a dress why because it's only one dress how did we know that because we have a a a dress see the next pic uh, next page please here you have to put the right answer in the right space and you see the small uh, wrong the the wrong sign and the right sign this means that if you have wrong sign like this it means that you have to put it in negative what does negative mean it means that you have to add not not in this uh, to uh, after the verb okay and as i told you in the uh, first lesson there is a video for you uh, to go through the a verb to have if you have any problem with it just tell me and we'll do it together again 
so this part you have to put the right answer have got or has got hasn't got or having got according to the sign between the two brackets okay i want you to watch the other video of the verb to have revision and then try to answer this part the uh, part of uh, exercise d and if you still have a problem with it just notify me okay this is going to be your page for today the homework page for today try to answer it yourself and send it back to me and if you have any problem with anything just notify me please number e is very easy you have to choose the right word from between the two red words it's about the possessive pronouns try to do it yourself and then number f it's very easy you have to rearrange the word sorry the sentence write it again and then match it with the right picture try to answer it yourself and feed me back with your answer take care see you soon